Hey guys, JDiverGH22 here, Josh Taylor, and today I'm just going to be doing a body modification update. Nick Rocks had requested this video a while back, and I just have been very bu very busy once again. Uh, so I actually had some time to do it today. Get some coffee. Uh, so to start out, I don't have very many piercings anymore. My lobes are at zero gauge. Nothing special there. Uh, my cartilage just has a stud in it right now. Uh, I have a 16 gauge dock piercing. My 16 gauge tragus. 14 gauge conch. And my rook got ripped out a few months ago by this little thing. So, I don't know when or if I'll get a rook again. But it was fun while it lasted. Uh... And then I have my nipples at 10 gauge, so pretty straightforward. My first tattoo was the Deathly Hollows, and I'm making a note that I was the first person on YouTube to have this tattoo, or show that I have it. Uh, so there it is, stuff on my upper back. I like it quite a bit, just simple, thick black line work. My second tattoo was a $20 Friday the 13th tattoo. That's right here. Can't see it that well. It's just smoking a joint. My third tattoo is the Super Mushroom from uh, Super Mario Brothers. That was also a $20 Friday the 13th tattoo. My fourth tattoo was this cross, I believe, and uh, it doesn't look straight when I go like that, but whatever. Uh, that was Friday the 13th, $13 tattoo. This tattoo was also a Friday the 13th, $13 tattoo. Uh, this I got for free because these two got messed up, so he gave it to me for free, and that just shows where I'm from in Michigan. It's where Ionia, Michigan is. So, then I got my anti-possession tattoo for my birthday this year, 2016. Uh, I'd wanted it for several years, and I love the way it looks, and who doesn't love Supernatural? So, got that, and then this peace sign at the same time. She kind of just did it for free because I wanted it, so that was cool. Uh... What was next? I believe. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, I forgot my equality tattoo. That was like my fifth one, I believe. That was over a year ago. I did it myself, and then in January of this year, my or a tattoo artist touched it up, so still looks all right. Um. Then I got my dollar sign tattoo, I believe, and these might be out of order. Uh, so just so you know. Uh, $13 tattoo once again. I got my lightning bolt with rain cloud. Same time, $13 tattoo. My diamond was also a $13 tattoo. And then I got this coffee cup as a $13 tattoo as well because coffee runs in my veins, clearly. Um, I then... Did this one myself. I don't know if you can see it. Probably can't. Damn. Um, you see it's like a nice D. It's just like, you know, the, on your keyboard if you type uh, exclamation. If you type a capitalized X and D right together, it looks like someone's going like, like laughing really hard. So I thought it was an interesting one to do. So I just... The stick and poke of it. Can't see it very well, sorry. Um, these dots I did myself, stick and poke. Uh, they fade pretty quickly, so it's kind of like semi permanent. Because, like, this one, for example, used to be covered till the end. It was a stick and poke that I did all in one uh, sitting, and it's already faded. This one as well was a stick and poke, it just lived. Um, 
it'll fade soon even more so I just kind of wanted to mess around with my fingers and hands uh, semicolon I did myself stick and poke it's quite faded obviously and I just haven't really cared about touching it up or anything I kind of think it looks cool faded actually um, yeah I decided to do that because of what it supports um, then I have this one on my toe it's just a little crappy smiley face I don't even know if I can show it but it's right there it's just a little smiley face I don't think you can see it sorry guys and Last but not least, I kind of have like a section of my thigh for sticking pokes, and I'm not going to do any more, but this was just when I had like a midlife crisis and was unemployed for a few weeks. Let's see if it'll focus. I don't know, man. Uh, but yeah, basically, there's just a pizza slice because I've always worked with pizza on and off. Uh, just a wine glass spilling over. Because I love wine and I don't know why I thought it'd be a cool idea to do that. But I did. A little X just because. I'm not straight edge. Uh, upside down triangle. Support gay life. And skate. Because I love to skate. So obviously they're not the best. But there's something to be said about doing your own stick and poke tattoo. It's just kind of a mesmerizing experience. So, let's see, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I think I have 20 tattoos now. Now, that's not included with professional ones. Professional ones I've got... 13 I think maybe uh, so if you guys like this video make sure to give it a like and thumbs up I'm now at 618 subscribers so thank you all for staying tuned in I really appreciate it uh, don't know what's going on with videos as of this time I haven't been able to skate in like about a month which really sucks uh, I just had my first day off a couple days ago and a couple weeks so just been working and plugging away so thank you guys for watching please subscribe if you haven't already and stay tuned for more videos i promise i will be making a couple more if not a few more videos before the end of the year so thank you guys peace out